Hi guys and welcome to my channel once again and welcome to the very first episode of Periwinkle Glades where I'm going to be building a little world of I don't know cuteness so anyways I um, started to uh, make this bakery and unfortunately I seem to be the unluckiest person ever because I always end up where it's not recording and it makes me sad <laughs> so this is why we're starting with it basically almost finished uh, we're just gonna add some details in and um, that will be the bakery pretty much done so yeah I went around and I started adding some things and um, I can really decide what I wanted to put in here but I finally figured it all out Okay guys, so I went around and I decorated inside and I um, put some little tables and chairs out and a little sign and um, what else did I do? Um, put some pancakes on the little table because everyone loves pancakes. <laughs> um, then I decided that I should probably add some flowers and things outside and some roses and um so I went around and I did all that and I put like a wall of roses behind because I didn't like the um dirt showing it was like a little bit boring so I kind of want to cover that up and like I said yeah I went and put all the little flowers out and you'll find they're mostly just pink and white flowers um, that I've put out and that was pretty much done with the bakery and the bakery is all finished and now I decided I was going to move on over here I wasn't quite sure what I was going to build here at first and um, I had a few things in mind but it ended up being an ice creamery a nice well an ice cream shop uh, with a, I really wanted the heart window, so I, I um, put the heart window in because I just think it looks really cute, and um, I tend to <laughs> build things and change my mind and take them away. So you'll see a lot of things pop up and then they'll disappear. <laughs> So here I was um, very undecided with actually what I wanted. Um, I kept changing my mind because I wasn't really, I didn't like how everything kept looking. Um, I knew what I wanted in my head but it wasn't looking how I wanted actually when I was building it so I kept changing it a lot um, until I finally ended up with something that I was happy with. So now it starts to take shape a little bit and I get more of an idea of how I actually want it to look and um, oh I love this little path, the little path 
It's so cute. I love that it sort of blends in with the grass. I think it's like my favourite path. <laughs> oh. But yeah, as normal, I wasn't really sure in some parts how to have it. So once again, I'm adding things and taking them away. Just, you know, like just testing them out as to how I wanted it to look. Oh, I love this floor. So I like the pink and the white floor. The tiles is cute. <laughs> Okay, so now I decided I was gonna go around and do the roof now that the basic build of how I wanted it to look was finished and uh, once again I you know added some things took them away because I wasn't happy with how it looked uh, and then decided to put the tile roof on because I really love tile roofs I just think they're cute wasn't sure if I wanted it to be flat or um, a peak kind of roof and decided to go with a peaked roof. Um, I changed it a little bit here and there because once again I couldn't decide. <laughs> um, added some roses. I love roses so I like cute stuff and the roses just make it look even cuter. So I'm always going to add roses in my builds. Um, I just really love the roses. And decided that I would do some something around the entrance um, I couldn't really decide what I wanted to do there but um, took a little while to figure that out and um, I went along and added the roses along the back wall again because um, I just think that's really cute So here I am just adding some more roses around and little pots, um, added some more tables and chairs and the umbrellas and um, I was once again adding things, taking them away, trying to decide what looks the best, uh, like the little lamps outside, the little lanterns, they're cute. I went around and added some more decorations around and um, because I like to add lots and lots of decorations I um, like to make it look as realistic as I can possibly get it to look and so I added a lot more decorations around inside and um, this is it like it is basically finished now um, like I said this is just the first episode of Periwinkle Glades. Um, there will be more to come obviously. I'm going to be um, creating more shops and stores and houses and all kinds of things in this world. Um, so you guys need to look out for that because that will be a thing. It will be happening. Um, it's something that I'm going to work on over time and um, just create my own little world of cuteness I guess <laughs> so here you can see that both the little stores are both finished the bakery and the ice cream shop yay it looks so cute and I can't wait to continue on and add more things into the world and more shops and more houses and if you guys have any ideas of what you'd like to see me add to Periwinkle Glades then drop a comment and let me know what you guys want me to add in and I will definitely do that. Um, oh, I went and added some trees up behind here just to make it look a bit more nicer and more in the, I guess the forest kind of look like more of a parkland behind it. Okay guys, so here we have the finished product, yay! And um, I hope you guys enjoyed it, I had so much fun building it and making it for you. And um, if you did enjoy it and you want to see more, then don't forget to subscribe and like and hit the notifications button so you can get notified of when all my new videos come out. And thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.
Thank you.